Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Keisha and as promised, I wanted to come back with a part two of a collective haul for my hotel, for my apartment. So let's just get started with this video. way too many stores i went to five and below walmart dollar store home goods tj maxx the list goes on all yesterday and i picked up um majority of the stuff at five and below because i know they have cheaper things there and um it was just really really cute so i spent most of my money at um five and below and if i remember prices i will tell you if not i mean yeah i have my receipt somewhere <laughs> So let's start off with a, what's in front of me, which is five below. And all their pillows were $5, price is still on there. This one I bought now, I bought things for my living room as well as my bedroom. So I'm not sure where everything is going yet. And then I bought these for the wall. I bought three of these and these are just the mounting ones. And I thought three was good enough. And it says it has everything that you need already in here. So it says mounting hardware already in here. So I'm hoping so because I'm not the best at putting things together. But yeah, I got three of those. And then I got another funky little pillow that I'm gonna put in my room. It goes well with my comforter. So it's purple, lavender. I think it's really, really cute. And then I bought a stool for my son, you know, when he's brushing his teeth, washing his hands, and the bathroom, needed one of these. I also got this pillow for my bedroom. They had a cute white one, but even though I'm trying to, thank you truck, I'm trying to transition my son into his own room, I still bought a pillow of this color instead of the white one. And this one was five as well and it says shoot for the stars so my room is kind of like purple blue gray like those type of i guess warm colors kind of um i bought this one for my room as well and this one is more of a sky blue teal dark blue type of color so those are the ones i bought for my room those three and then for my living room i'm thinking more of a neutral type of hotel type of look where you're having like the white the vanilla the off white the peach off peach that type of color um tan so i bought this tan pillow which i thought was super duper cute it's just a round pillow i think i'm gonna match um these two together i think that would be cute and then i brought this throw over which is, it doesn't say a color, but I would say this is like um, a peachy color, off peach. And I think it would look cute with these three. And then I bought the last pillow for my living room. I thought this went cute together. This, this, and then this one. I think it will go well together. So I don't know, I'm gonna try to keep my son away from it. I think it's not the best colors to have like a child around, but I mean, I tried. And then, the last bag from the dollar, not the dollar store, five and below, is I bought this. It says not all who, oops, not all who wonder are lost. I thought this was cute, and I'll probably put this like on my desk or either on my wall, um, in my bedroom. I thought this was cute as well, and this, it's like hard. Um, it needs batteries. It doesn't come with batteries, so I, I bought some batteries. <clears throat> Hopefully, it works. Um, but I bought two of them. Then I'm going to leave one in my closet and then one in my room. And then that's everything from five and below. Now from, what else is in front of me? I think this is Walmart. Is this Walmart? Okay, Walmart, I just bought a whole bunch of random stuff. I bought some of their candles. This is Cranberry Mandarin. This one is pumpkin spice. <clears throat> I don't know, the older I get, the more I'm into like fall smells like pumpkin, pumpkin spice, apple, si apple spice, cinnamon. I don't know, I love those types of um, 
of fragrances. Last one I got was Apple Pumpkin. Let me smell this. Ew, I don't... It smells okay, but I like these like all year round. I don't know, I love the smell of like apple cinnamon in the house. Random, super random, but I bought some painkillers. I bought a rug for my bathroom. I needed one of these. And then I bought this lamp. I have a lamp in my living room already, but I think I'm gonna change it to my room. And then I bought this one for my living room. So I thought it was a little bit cuter. It was $25, which I don't think was a bad price, especially because I'm super duper cheap. So that's all I got in Walmart. And then when I went to Home Goods and um, I went to Home Goods and TJ Maxx, and I just got a few, I guess you could say like statement pieces because I mean, you, I was really like looking around in TJ Maxx for about like, 30 minutes to an hour and I only got three things and that's because a lot of their things are pretty expensive and I just wanted some statement pieces for the house so this is the first one that I got and I'm gonna put um some candles in here three candles and this was six dollars so this was like one of the first things I picked up now even though these aren't gonna look I would have to get bigger ones than this but they didn't have any in Walmart so I think I'm just going to buy, I would have to look around because I don't know what's going to exactly fit this perfectly. So I was going to get three from Yankee Candle, but I don't know. So I'm going to look around. I love candles. But for now, I'm just going to throw these in there. These three can just go right in here for now. That's fine. And I think for $6, this isn't bad because I thought this was really, really cute. Um... Another thing I bought from, I wonder if I can take this off. Another thing I bought from TJ Maxx was this, which was super cute to me. And it says inbox. And this was $10. Um, you just, you know, throw your mail in there. I swear I have mail everywhere. I need to buy a shredder. And then the last thing I bought from, this was from TJ Maxx. And this was $7. And I thought this was cute. Just a little statement piece. Um, of course, this is fake. And then the elephant, I thought this was really cute for $6. I thought this was really, really cute. Is there something in, oh, there's fragrance in there. That smells really good. There's like fragrance inside of here. I'm looking like if you can open it up and I, I don't know if you can. Oh, you can. You can actually open this up and I'm guessing maybe put a candle in there or just put like one of those bag fragrances in there because that's what's in there right now. But I think I'm gonna put this on the um, thing that I got from Walmart and just let it sit on there so Jabari doesn't get it and try to break it. All right, the last place I went was the dollar store. And here I just bought a whole bunch of random stuff, um, clean goods and all that stuff. I bought another one of these. I love these sponges that you just um, clip onto that thing and you can wash that way. Like I said, I love apple cinnamon. I love these. Um, some soap, air freshener. I got some batteries from the dollar store. What is this? Oh, I got some soap. I wanted to try this one. This is the wild flower and honey. And then I got, oh, what is this? toilet bowl cleaner I guess I'm in like a lavender type of thing right now and then my last bag oh no I got this from um five and below I forgot all about this I think I'm gonna put this in my room but I got like a did I get this from five and below I might have got this from the dollar store this looks like five and below though I think I got this from the dollar store I'm not sure I either got this from the dollar store or five and below it's in the dollar store bag Maybe I did get this from the dollar store. I think I did. But anyway, it holds up to 12 pounds. So I can put like some of my bags on here that of course don't have anything in there. So I'm either going to put this in my living room or like right by the door. Or, um, or I can put like keys on here too. That might work. I can put some keys on here. So yeah, I got this. I thought this was really cute. Um, I believe I got a knife from the dollar store before, so I picked this up. I think this is good. I'm not sure, I don't remember. But um, I got to a little bit of decor from the dollar store as well. I just wanna see how it's gonna look in my living room. So 
I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this yet, but I bought a few of these. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. If I'm gonna put candles in here, I'm not sure yet, but um, I was thinking about picking up some marbles that I didn't, so I'm not sure yet, but I have this. Um, I have two, I have two, of, I think I have three of them. Yeah, I bought three of those actually. And then to go with like the pinkish, vanilla, whatever, whatever type of color, I bought this like rusted looking thing. And I probably will just throw this on top um, of something, on top of those white bars that I have. And probably just leave it there. I think it looks cute on its own. I believe, what else did I buy from the dollar store? Oh, I bought this, um, home, home Sweet Home. I bought this to put on the shelves as well. I thought this was cute, a cute addition. I bought another candle. I probably will not like this candle. It's just for show and it has like that uh, peachy off-white type of color to it. And then I have these candles as well, which I'll probably light. Um, these I got from the dollar store. And this one is Mango Blood Orange. And the other one is Fresh Peaches. Ooh, that smells good. So these I'll probably hang up on the wall just, mm, just for decoration for real, for real. But I'll see how everything goes. And all together with all this stuff, I think I fit under 200, I think. I don't know. Maybe I'll put it in like the description. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'll try to do another one if you guys want to see like a finished look um, of the apartment because I'm still decorating. I've been here for about a month now. And like I said, I'm still decorating little by little. And um, I'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.